What's good guys? It's me again. I'm gonna do another um, unboxing for you guys. Uh, we just picked something up for my garage. Actually for my tools so I can organize them here in my garage because um, right now I have my tools all over the place in different bins. Let me show you what I'm talking about. It's kind of dark. I apologize. Let me get this out of the way. Sorry. So I got some tools in here, these little drawer bins. Got some in here, got some in here. Um, got screws. Um, let's see, basically, I have, I have tools everywhere. I have tools in, in this little drawer bin too. Um, oh, and this little bin, I got screwdrivers, um, Allen wrenches, um, vice grips. Basically everything, this, you know, um, the smaller tools will go in there, but the other day, um, I sat down and said, I can't do this anymore. I got to have everything all in one area, one in, in organized in um, one space, so that way I'm not like going here, 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 you know, everywhere, just to get a tool, a screwdriver, a wrench, uh, Allen wrench, um, don't matter. Um, so what I did was I went to Sears. Um, they had a sale over the weekend. Um, I actually started on Sunday and I got me a, a Craftsman tool chest. Um, so it was actually on sale. Normally it was, I think it was like 160 bucks, but um, for the weekend, um, I think for a few days, uh, it went on sale. So I got it for $99. So it wasn't bad. So, um, and it'll help me be more organized with my tools. I'm not having to run everywhere like I, I keep mentioning because it, get, it becomes a headache because I have to search everywhere just to find a damn tool. So let me show you guys what I got. So what I did was I picked up this Craftsman 5 Drawer Tool Center. Um, let's see here. It says full extension, ball bearing drawer slides, drawer slides holds. Um, holds, holds 30 pounds per drawer. That's not bad. Or it organizes small parts, hand tools and power tools. Um, key, lock, key locking system for safety and security. Total load rating of 300 pounds. And this is what it looks like. It's still in the box, but I'm going to take it out here in a second. So um, it has wheels. And you got a bottom part that you open up and it's like a little compartment you can put um, power tools in um, and it's five drawers so it's not bad not bad at all plus come to a three-year warranty um, and like I said it's a craftsman I got it at Sears um, so let me show you what I got uh, give me a sec so as you open the box Flip one side, other side, another side, and that's what you got. Woo! Uh, comes with uh, some sort of owner's operator's manual. Um, she just shows you all the pieces in here, the wheels, um, all the different parts. So I believe this is the key, so you can lock everything in there for security and whatnot, privacy. So. So let me toss this to the side and got this styrofoam piece for the packaging. Put the key over here so I don't lose it, knowing me I will. So I will have to take this out and you guys will have to wait and see. So as you can see, I got it out of the box, but it's pretty heavy, so I had to kind of turn it over upside down and um, kind of not dump it out, but gently remove it from the box. So there's more styrofoam packaging. And currently, it's upside down, so I have to turn it up, right side up. And it's, it's, it's heavy. 
pretty sturdy. pretty good. It rolls nice and smooth. And here we go. So I'm not, I think these are the wheels, the caster rack or caster pack. So you got more owner's manuals. It's probably the same thing as Actually it is. So I got duplicate copies of the operator's manual. See that one, this one that was on the top of the box when I first opened it. And this is the one that was inside the actual um, tool chest. So, I'm not sure, but this rubber mat, oh, I was gonna say it probably for the bottom of the, of the um, sliding drawer, but it doesn't really fit. So, but as you can as you can see, what you do is pull up the door, and then when it gets to the top, you slide it, and voila, there's the top piece. So, um, got more black tape for the packaging. Take that off. So I will put this, actually I really don't have to put it together. I just take this part out and place it on top and that's it. Um, but before then I still have to screw in the wheels. So that'll be in the next clip. All right, here's the finished product. Um, it took me a while because I had to put the wheels on. I had to put some screws and nuts and attach the wheels. I got one locking wheel. Um, this top one, see look, it's unlocked so you can actually lock it, there's a key, but, but here's a key right here, put something on top here, and then if you remove this, you can actually have, you can lock the storage with other drawers, right, screwdrivers, wrenches, small, um, smaller tools up here and then down here. This drawer is a little bit bigger, a little bit thicker, so it's deeper. Bigger tools like hammers or whatever you guys want. There's a bigger one down here. Pretty spacious. And like I showed you earlier, here's the bottom compartment. Yes. So you can get it anywhere. Probably any hardware store, I'm sure of it. So I got a Craftsman. Um, it's the Craftsman 5 Drawer Tool Center. Uh, I believe the part number is this. The item number is 31013. If you're looking for this exact model. Um, I like it. So I can organize my tools. Like I said, it has a nice glossy black finish to it shiny and this doesn't attach I'm sure you could I'm sure you can attach it somehow but I'm sure what's um, it's pretty heavy anyway so it's not gonna be this ain't gonna be moving around but I'm happy I have I can clear up all this clutter over here and put it all in here so hope you guys oh good time the garage light turned off Apologize that it's dark now, but it's the Craftsman 5-Drawer Tool Center. 
I got it. It's, it was going for retail as one sixty. I got it for ninety nine dollars. So I'm not sure what it'll cost at other like Home Depot or Lowe's or Ace. I don't know if Ace Hardware is still around, but go to a hardware store near you, and I'm sure you can go find one. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for my next unboxing and reveal. All right, guys.